Hello, I've added a newer version to the GitHub of the Quicksaw Bridge which adds these two options for selecting the mesh and setting the mask. So with the PBR loader in Modo, if you don't have a mesh selected, so let's say we select the camera or the light, uh, and we load a PBR, um, it doesn't have any clue as to what UV map to do, so I made it just set it to solid, which is just the first one. Um, however, if you if you have a mesh selected and you load the same PBR uh, and you go to your texture locator, uh, it's set to set to the UV map, the currently active UV map. So in this case, it's uh, texture. Um, so what this option does. For the Quixel bridges, if you import a mesh, uh, it will add a new step in to the to the cycle of what it does, uh, where it will select the mesh before it loads the materials in, um, and that's controlled by this stage interval because it has to wait for the mesh to finish loading. So you can, should be able to ignore these numbers, but they should, if you need to change them, you can. Um, so to just show you that working, uh, if we export. What this does now is it gets set to the U, the UV map of the mesh. Um, so all that's doing is it'll, it brings the FBX in, which is what it did before, and then it says this is the mesh that I found in my current um, in the current import, and I've selected it. It selects it only selects one mesh, so it's whichever is the first mesh, um, and the set mask option is basically the same what it will do is whatever the first mesh is that's selected is we will set as the item mask here so uh, this rock here has got that mesh if I add another mesh in you see it's not affected by the rock texture which it would have been previously um, but that's what that set mask does uh, the same principle is if you've got your own mesh so if you've got this mesh uh, and your UV map is that's the wrong one. Is texture. Um, if you want to bring in a surface, uh, just choose any of these. Let's choose this one. Uh, what that will do is, oh, did, did I have the mesh selected? I can't remember. Uh, yeah, I did. So it, because the mesh was selected, it um, set it to UV map, and because I had this set mask set, it's locked it to my to the first selected mesh that I had. Um, this generally works okay. There is some issues if it if the FBX brings in multiple meshes like this one, um, then that one doesn't get it because it set this item mask to be the first one. So what you might want to do in that scenario is not set the mask. Um, And then it's just going across everything. Um, yep, that's up on the GitHub now if uh, people want those features. Uh, thanks.